Hi. Hello. How are you? What are you guys doing? Taking a break from the sun. Are you guys on break? We are. Both of you? What's up? You you? No, you guys are both on break? I'm just taking a break from the sun. I know, but I'm talking. Do you need something? But if you're on break, how could you help me? Can you help? I can, I can obviously help you if I'm not on break. But it doesn't matter. Are you on a break though? If I want to help you. I you want me to help you? you want help? I'm asking if you're on a break. I don't know. You're talking me or her. Both of you. Okay. Are you on a break? I can help you. I said, are you on a break? Well, I was taking a break from the sun, but if you need help, I a can A break help from you. the sun? I mean your job. No. You're not on a break? Are you on a break? What does it matter to you? Is your finger okay? Because you're bleeding. What does what matter? Because you work for the people, right? Okay. So shouldn't the people be concerned on what you do? How about you get out of the street? I mean, you're on a break. I don't even think you could get out of your car because the motorcycle's blocking it to even... What'd you say? So I can get out of the way pretty quick. A lot of officers are asking for more money. So then you find a lot of officers just sitting around doing nothing and you wonder, do they need more money? That's all. Well, I asked if you need help with your finger and you're not answering. I didn't ask. I asked if you're on a break. You said you're on a break from the sun. You don't work for the sun. You work for the people. I'm sorry, I just didn't want to get dehydrated. Are you the only female motorcycle officer? I saw on Instagram they promoted, they shared you. I did. Were you excited for that? It's an honor. What do you think of the other department officers? Like, uh, do you know Officer Goff? Yeah, Detective Goff? You know he killed an unarmed man when working for LAPD? Yeah, Detective Goff. Oh. Maybe you should know about Tom Corey. Do you know about that officer? You should look into that. Officer Goff did kill an unarmed man named Reginald Doucette. Did you know that? And then BHPD hired him. Do you not want to send him You're facing the wrong way. You should be concerned with you. You're, I don't, have you had anything to drink today? You're, have you had anything to drink? Have you had anything to drink today? Water, that's it? Would you mind following my finger? Excuse me. This is what the cops do. But they need more money. Do you get any good footage of me or? Who says I'm getting footage of you? Oh, okay. I'm just holding a cell phone. Oh yeah, me too. Oh, okay. There we go. How you doing? Fine. How you doing? Good. What is this? Are you an officer? It's a good question. Okay. Just do me a favor. Don't get too close to us, all right? Are you an officer? I'll let you figure it out. You don't answer that? I can't go through here? Are you waving through? Oh, I know, I just wanted to wait. Anyway, I'm gonna go through. Hate your attitude. Yeah. What's up, buddy? Hey, can I get your name and badge number? Go stand in that corner. I'll deal with you later. Can I get your name and badge number? Can I get his name and badge Right now you're interrupting oh, okay. this stop, okay? Oh. Unless you want to get in trouble, I strongly suggest you get away from here. Oh, okay. All right? I'll okay. talk to you later. Okay, tough guy. Hey, can I get your name and badge number, though? I'm not done here yet. I told you when I'm done, I talk to you. Okay, I'll figure it out. Okay, bye-bye. I was just wondering what your name and badge number is. Let's put your skateboard down first. Why? Because you're being stopped on a municipal code violation. You're going to get my name and badge number on a citation. For what? Skateboarding on the sidewalk in the business district. You can't skateboard in the sidewalk? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Okay, why don't you put that down?
For a ticket, I'm not allowed to do anything like this? Yeah, For a ticket? Put that down until okay. we're done here. You okay. can lay it down any way you want. Okay, I'll put it down. So I, I'm being detained right now? Correct, yes. Okay. Well, Officer Carrot. Yeah, whatever you want to okay. right. Could I have a walk commander come? Well, I think I'm being harassed by the officers right now, and I'm nervous, and I would like a walk commander here. There's nothing to be nervous about. Well, I'm nervous. I don't care. I don't, hey, sir, I don't care. Put your hands on your knees. Sir, I don't care. If you're not nervous, I'm nervous. I don't so I'm care asking if you're for a watch commander. No. Police yes, officer Goff. Yes, officer Goff at the Beverly Hills Police Department, desk 347. How come you don't wear a And I also uniform? have my serial number right here. And you're misspelling up my last what name. Are you a robot? You have a serial number? After you sign this here, you're going to get a copy of the ticket. Yes, sign an admission to guilt. You can test it in court. I'm aware. Okay? And That's also, right. now you know about the municipal code violation. Very aware. Could you tell me why you don't wear a uniform? No. Officer Golf. This is Officer Goff. This is Officer Goff. Be careful, he killed an unarmed guy. Corner? Yeah, right there, because we're conducting an investigation. Oh, okay. okay. Right now, you're obstructing that. Okay? I'm just, just stand right there. You're talking to me. Right there, because I'm still over there. Over there. Excuse me? The the what did you just say, though? Uh, uh, so you, uh huh. Okay, you get away How come? Why is that though? For my safety. But you know who I am, right? You just said my name. You said my first name. Yes, I'm. So I'm. I you. Is something. Do I. Have I ever done something wrong that would make your uh, safety a threat? I'm conducting an investigation. Right, so you stop talking to me. I don't know. I don't know who you are. But he knows. He knows. He has more stripes than you. He said my first name, right? Okay. All right, so we're okay. I don't know. I didn't say your I'm not a threat to anybody. Go over there, dude. Not a threat to anybody. There's no caution tape up, and I'm on a curb. So if, I don't know what you're thinking, but it's a public sidewalk. I, I don't want you. But am I a threat to you? Have you ever felt that? Right now? Yeah. We can have a one-on-one. -on -one no, I'm asking if you've ever felt. I'm. I'm asking if you've ever felt like I've had a threat with you. Have you ever been threatened by me? We've always had a cordial relationship. Right. So how come when I'm filming it's an issue? You were threatened by me too, right? Someone holding two phones and a skateboard. That's threatening you. You shouldn't be a cop. You don't know me? You have a gun on your hip. I'm holding two phones and a skateboard. If I appear threatening, you shouldn't be a cop. I don't know you. Okay? I didn't say That's you did. Question. I said you shouldn't be a cop. Okay. Yeah, I know it is. So are you guys done here harassing him? You had them in handcuffs to give him a ticket? Is that normal? Yeah, I'm not going to discuss business Okay, well, I'll ask them what they think. Okay. So when are you guys leaving? What's your rank? A training officer? So you train other officers? When I met you with Officer Goff, he was training you, right? Was that correct? Officer Goff was your training officer. Yes. The guy who killed an unarmed man when working for LAPD was your training officer. Interesting. Did you know that that ticket that you had me put my feet in the curb for, that never got filed? Did you know that? So what are you guys doing now? Huh? I said, what are you doing now? Oh, okay. That's cool. You're now training people, and the guy who trained you killed an unarmed man when working for LAPD. That's really good. I hope everyone now knows this. You at least know it, and you're being trained by him. So at least you know that the guy who trained you was trained by someone who, was, who killed an unarmed man. You should look that up. You should look up Officer Aaron Goff. You should do that. LAPD, that family was paid out over a million dollars.
because of the guy who trained him. You ever think of that? Hey, why don't you look at the car? You're looking at me. For what? Yeah, I think. Let's get out of here. All right, look up Officer Aaron Goff and Reginald Doucette. And then if you pray, if you meditate, think about the family and the holiday they'll never spend with their family again because of the guy who trained you. That's what you should do. That's what you should do when you go home.